All right, I'm about to do this little video vlog shit. I'm frosty, man. I'm from the A65, Knoxville, Tennessee, man. It's gonna be my first little video or whatnot. I'ma tell y'all now, I ain't really trying to make like a job, a hobby or nothing out of this. I just, just gonna do this is my 1989 Chevy Caprice Classic Broham. Uh, this is as is. This is exactly how I bought it. Just got this car two days ago. I got this back piece right here. This crack. I'm gonna have to replace that. But everything is as is. Got the original hub caps in at the crib. I mean, down in the basement. Got them in the crib, so it's intact right there. My front one's intact. I think he, I think whoever the guy that bought it replaced that anyway. That looks brand new, it's not even the same color. It's black. That's my room. Chair, man, two tone. Room. Roof is immaculate, bro. Look like it was just put on there. Like I said, bro, ham. I got these guts right quick. You see guts, man. Power everything. Power windows, power seats, power locks, except the side mirrors. Of course, you move them with that. Original everything in here, man. See, they put a CD player in it. I got these chargers in there. I got the lighter too, though. I still got the actual lighter. Got the original owner's manual. You know what I'm saying? Original owner's manual, man. Like I said, this is a Chevy Caprice. I got the history. All that good stuff, man. Roof look great. My liner is great, man. Got my boys car seats in here. I'm a father, of course. I got six kids. There's just two of them. But the guts, man. Guts is... It's interior, man. Like I said, everything is as is, too. Everything as is. This is exactly how I bought it. Exactly how I got it, man. Let me crank this thing up for y'all, man. Now, excuse me. Like I said, hey, I am not a real YouTuber. This is literally my first time doing it. Oh, no, what's going on with this key? Start it for y'all, man. In my head, Ain't got no pipes or nothing on there like that, man. It's just straight up uh it's car cover. Gotta put a car cover on it. I got these trees, man. I don't got no garage, got these trees, man. Oh need them doing my paint bad. Shit, man. Lights on the doors work, everything in there, you know what I mean? Not sure what in there, but you know, eventually over time I'm gonna do something to it, you know what I'm saying? I got some improvements I wanna do. I definitely wanna go from the ground up. Build it out of the way, you know, like out of the rust and stuff is getting over there and all that, you know, the car 30, 30 years old, you know what I mean? I feel like they need to be taken care of. It's a little bit next and that, but yeah. Definitely a steal, definitely a great find, man. Two owners before me. You know what I mean? I got this car out of Charlotte, North Carolina, man. Drove it all the way back to where I stay. It's about three hours away. You know. So, you know, CD player work. I got the little, got the little auxiliary cord with the iPhone hook up so I can get my little iPhone hook up. I gotta get my AC right. You know, they converted all this stuff in 95 or whatnot, so I got the little converter. You know what I'm saying? To get my AC right, get it blowing snowballs, cause it blow right now, but it blow hot. <laughs> it ain't blowing 
go. So, you know, got to get that right. Can't be out here in the summertime with the windows down all the time. You know what I'm saying? Tint it, everything, like I said, as is. These flaps and all that stuff. Everything, the car is as is. These are 20-inch rims. I'm going to probably leave them on there, man. Throw some Vos on there. And leave it alone for a second, man. I got 412s I'm going to put in it. Um, not sure what size amp. I'm probably get another battery put in the back seat. That way I don't even, I mean, not in the back seat, but in the trunk. That way I don't got to worry about it messing up my alternator and my battery draining and all that good shit. So I'm going to get a new alternator anyway. I'm going to put a digital dash in there, steering wheel, um, you know, TV, well, DVD, CD player, whatever or whatnot. And I'm just ride and chill, man. You know, eventually I want to do some things to it. I want to put some mods on it, you know. Go ahead, completely flip it. Remix it. You know what I mean? My way. But yeah, man. Probably give me a panoramic in that motherfucker, man. As long as I can keep my top, though. Because my top mint. Well, so if I can keep my top and still get a panoramic sunroof, I might do that, man. But yeah, man, y'all tune in, man. You know what I mean? Like I said, man, I'm going to be giving y'all updates on every time I do something to it. You know what I mean? I ain't no real YouTuber or nothing like that, bro. I'm really just doing this because I got some free time. I love this car. It's a dream car of mine. I always wanted a box. If you're from the South, anywhere in the South, you know what I mean, or Midwest, you know, we love these box Chevys, bro. Everybody want them a box, a good, clean box. You know what I mean? We call them dinosaurs. Everybody want to get them a dinosaur, man. So I done found me one, man, and I'm going to share it with y'all. You know what I'm saying? So, let go.